Hey y'all! Today we're looking at people who literally just had one job and they couldn't even do that. Have you ever been in an accident that resulted in your death? Yes or no? How would I answer this if I was dead? Has anyone answered yes? Now that I want to know. Who answered yes? Get them on the phone. We have to talk to them. We need answers now. Okay, whoever built this just did, did not like kids very much. <laughs> just say you don't like kids and move on. Don't make a torture trap for them to fall into. Who knows where that goes? Well, actually, it's the sewer. <laughs> I know where it goes. Never been down there, but I've heard it's not a very nice place. Best typo 2017, okay. In the years after Napoleon's rise and fall as emperor of France, Beethoven was in a flurry of musical writing. Being dead did not stop him in the slightest while recovering quickly and going on with his music. Sure, it was much harder, but he got through <laughs> so Beethoven is the one clicking yes on this photo. I love that. Sure, it was much harder, but he got through it. Being dead did not slow him down. <laughs> Hopefully no one reads this straight across from left to right like I did. You don't matter. Give up. Oh, <laughs> you matter. Don't give up. <laughs> Y'all know I hate these. <sighs> you don't matter. Give up. <laughs> if I saw that driving down the road, I'd be like, Thanks, man. Thanks. We're hiring part-time and full-time servers, serve people, greeters, greet people, line cooks, cook people, food. <laughs> I bet nobody even noticed that that was a problem until many, many weeks later when someone was like, you do what at this restaurant? What's in your burgers? What kind of meat? That's so funny. What do you think they scratched out right here? Some other buffoonery? <laughs> do you have at least one year of zero experience? Do you speak United States? <laughs> oh. <laughs> this whole survey is bad. Do you have at least one year of no experience? I have many years of zero experience, actually. Thanks for asking. And do you speak United States? And what language would that be, huh? <laughs> Mistakes are proof you are trash. <laughs> do you think some, like, silly librarian <laughs> I was like, watch this. I'm gonna put a trash can in front of this. I, you know what? I actually think it's probably just an accident. A funny, funny accident. I bet nobody even noticed. Except the person that took this photo. <laughs> but they were the only ones that noticed. I wonder what it says underneath. Mistakes are proof you are human? Mistakes are proof you are normal? <laughs> trash. Mistake equal trash. In memory of World War XI. <laughs> Oh no. Oh, this is so disrespectful. Oh, who did that? <laughs> oh, y'all, we have to proofread this. This was engraved into something. Like, you, you're not gonna be able to just like quickly fix it. You're gonna have to print a whole new plate. Oh my God. And the fact that it, they glued it on there and it's already stuck on there makes me think that they're probably not gonna change it and it's probably gonna say that forever until someone makes a big enough deal about it and then they'll probably change it. But they're like, eh, maybe people won't notice. Oh, a crunchy vegetable salad. I will take 20 of those. And that's the first time I've ever said that. And they all say that. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Y'all don't have another label that says crunchy ice cream salad? This looks bomb. It looks so good. Do you think it actually costs $5.19? It's a bit of a rip off, but it looks good. Oh my God, I have seen people do this. I've seen this in the flesh. Oh my God, it actually makes me so mad. People think that that's like a trolley. Do you not see this man? And a, a true example of knowledge, <laughs> just common sense. You take the basket off of the thing. It's not like a basket on wheels. If you want a basket on wheels, they have very big ones that you can carry around. Do you think she saw this and that's why she stopped and she's like, hmm, wait a minute. Do you think she looked back and she was like, huh, am I doing this wrong? She took that from the entrance. <laughs> I have seen this in person before and I've, I've watched the employee of the grocery store have to go up to that person and be like, um, Ma'am, it's actually, that's the stand that holds the basket. And they lifted up the basket and the bewilderment on the person's face when they saw that, it's like they'd never seen anything like it before in their lives. And I was like, what in tarnation am I witnessing? Turn right, left. Right. Does it say right and left? Oh my God. Oh my God. They wrote left over the existing right, but 
Wait, but I'm still confused. The arrow is pointing both directions. But this arrow and this arrow are going left. So I think it should have been left. But th this and this instructions are unclear. Honestly, go ahead and rip up the street. Start over. You guys messed up way too many times. And this isn't even sinner, which I hate. <laughs> you will marry me. It's not a question. It is a command. You, I'm not asking. I am telling you, you will marry me. Oh man, they have no idea. They look so happy. This guy's like, I got the big sign, the one that matters. <laughs> oh guys, no one told them who's taking the picture. I guess you could ask it like, you you will marry me? If you say it like that, it kind of sounds like a question. Otherwise it's just a command. Don't show us on camera. Our wives think we are at work. <laughs> and then they showed them on camera. Although this guy looks like he's having a freaking blast. They made the signs for a reason. They made the signs for a reason. If I was one of their wives, I would think this was really funny, actually. The amount of, they made posters. The amount of effort they went through to make this this picture possible, I couldn't even be mad. I couldn't be mad. It's too funny. Couple of guys being dudes. The job, <laughs> the job is well done. Except the job didn't get done. You're supposed to put that inside. Oh my, surprise ruined. The whole fun of getting a fortune cookie is being like, what did I get? You could do like crack it and pull it out. You ruined the surprise. And those little smiley faces are just extremely condescending. <laughs> Wait, this is at someone's house. Oh my God. I thought maybe that this was like in the pizza place. This is at someone's house. Look, look, there's like their countertop and the cabinets. Oh my God. They put the... How does this happen? It doesn't look like they even cut it. That would be a weird place to just set down the, the, the pizza roller while you went and did something else. Maybe they just set it down and the person thought that they cut it so they closed up the box and shipped it out. I don't know how this has happened. It's not even cut, so they never even got around to it. This looks like it started a cut, but that's it. It doesn't continue. Look, cause like this would be, yeah, I, I'm at a loss for words on this one. I don't know how this happened at all. I need the backstory. <laughs> Whose Sims house is this? Raise your hand. Whose Sims house is this? Who did this? Who's torturing their Sims like this? They can't get in. That is so funny. That's just a Sims house in real life. That's all that is. Oh my God. It's the Capri Sun to rule them all. It came with 25 straws. <laughs> you can go poke a billion holes in that thing. It's a one Capri Sun for 10 people at once. Who else read this as a threatening Yoda? Me marry, you will. <laughs> Another command! He doesn't look that happy. And I don't see a ring on her finger. But they're smiling, so... It must have gone well, I think. Me marry, you will? <laughs> She's probably like... Huh? I can see it now. I bet they both walked up to that. And he was like, open your eyes. <laughs> and she opened it and she was like... She had to read it a couple times and he was like, oh, come on. I bet you he saw it and he was like, they had one job and they ruined it. But this is a really funny proposal. I think this would be like a funny thing to, to have as a memory. You would never forget this proposal. You would never forget. Uh, I had given the bakery a photo on the USB drive to put on the cake. This is the cake they ended up making. Did they just take a picture of your USB drive? <laughs> Oh my gosh, this happens a lot. People who make these cakes in bakeries take things a little too literally, just a little. <laughs> it seems like more effort to take a photo of the USB. <gasps> it's a permanent traffic cone. They cemented it into the ground. <gasps> they also did a terrible job. Look at this. <laughs> Who did this? Don't hire them again. Oh, but it is so tempting. I would want to just go yoink and just take it out. If it was still like damp, oh my God, it would be so tempting to do that. Someone had to like actually pour that in there and they didn't think for a second that maybe that that, that I mean, they had to pour it around the cone. It's just pure laziness at its finest. Do not touch bread with hands. Please use tongue. <laughs> what? Oh, tongue? Baby? Oh my god, I think they were trying to say tongue. You think anyone actually took that seriously? I hope not. Y'all nasty. Cat, duck, fox. So now we're teaching children lies. So now we're lying to children? This is what it's come to. Who made this? You proud of yourself? You like lying to children? You think it's funny? They're gonna grow up thinking that that's a fox and then all the other kids are gonna laugh at them because they're wrong. <laughs> they're gonna be like, what the drinks are? Don't tell me it was a fox. Yeah, they lied to you. They lied to you. 
Is that a whole potato inside that chip bag? Ew, it's even got chips stuck to it. A whole potato? How did that happen? How did that happen? It's like seasoned and everything. It went through the whole factory as one whole potato. And no one noticed this giant chonker just going on a ride? Nobody noticed? Bizarre, but very funny. Makes for a good photo. 100% Australian bananas. That's weird. <laughs> Those bananas look like onions. <laughs> Australian bananas just built differently. <laughs> They're a little spicy. Oh, the why the they eat that? Why is it spicy? <laughs> One of these things is not like the other. <laughs> what utensils that? Is this supposed to be a fork? Oh my god! I think it's supposed to be a fork, but it didn't get cut. Oh, I don't like that. This gives me cursed energy. I'm not even sure why. Mm -mm. That photo actually might be cursed. That's cursed. More handiwork by my idiot brother-in-law. They screwed that in in the socket? Did it get electrocuted? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, no, 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 I'll do it for cheap. I'll do it for cheap. This is what cheap gets you. <laughs> Nonsense buffoonery. Buffoonery. When is the next Friday the 13th? Tuesday. <laughs> no, Google. No, you're not supposed to lie to us. We trusted you. Oh, that's so freaking funny. Tuesday, I mean, it technically is the 13th. But <laughs> it specifically says Friday. Oh, no. I tell the whole house. Mm -mm, no. At that point, cursed. Absolutely cursed. I couldn't live there. I'd, I'd have to just completely dismantle the entire thing or sell the place and move on. You know what? It's a thing of the past. We don't have to think about it anymore. It can't hurt us anymore if we move. Friendship key ring. <laughs> but you can't. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, for friends who aren't that close. <laughs> They're just beefries. Just a couple of beefries. No, okay. Yeah, you had one job. The arms go through the holes. Whoever did this one did a lovely job. But come on. This outfit sucks. And you couldn't even put the arms through. Jazz it up a little. Make it look nice. Is that? That's McDonald's. McDonald's. You know, I always thought McDonald's eyes had a little little flavor to it. Maybe that's what makes their Sprite so spicy. Oh, McDonald's Sprite could make a man fly. I swear has something in it. Thank you for applying. Thank you for your interest in company name. We wanted to reach out and assure you we have received your application for the position of job title. We're reviewing your application and we'll contact you shortly with next steps. Best regards, best regards. <laughs> all the time companies will email me and they will like forget to change that i've been called sir i've been called other youtubers names i've been called youtuber or insert youtuber name here it's bad it happens a lot <laughs> sometimes i let my kid have mcdonald's when i don't feel like cooking imagine my surprise when my son opened up a box full of tartar sauce that was supposed to have been a cheeseburger what in tarnation? So someone at McDonald's just filled a hamburger box with tartar sauce. They didn't think that was weird. No one saw them doing that. No one stopped them and was like, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you, why are you doing that? Why are you wasting tartar sauce? That went wrong there. <laughs> Supped, supped right there, supped. <laughs> and there's the culprit of the crime right there. Someone stopped, wait, no, no, wait. Someone stopped him. Someone stopped that man. <laughs> And last but not least, thank you. Thank you for watching today's video. I very much appreciate it. I made you this cake. Thanks for stopping by. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day and I'll speak to you all very, very soon. Bye-bye.